were done for the day. Yeah. Yeah, I was just sitting here. What happened to Sean? He still owns 7% of the company. All you had all day was that salad. You want to get something to eat? I can't. I'm not a bad guy. I know that. When there's emotional testimony, I assume 85% of it is exaggeration. And the other 15? Perjury. Creation myths meet a devil. What happens now? Sai and the others are having a stake on University Avenue. Then they'll come back up to the office and start working on a settlement agreement to present to you. They're gonna settle? Oh yeah. And you're gonna have to pay a little extra. Why? So that these guys sign a non-disclosure agreement. They say one unflattering word about you in public, you own their wife and kids. I invented Facebook. I'm talking about a jury. I specialize in voir dire, jury selection. What a jury sees when they look at a defendant. Clothes, hair, speaking style, likability. Likability. I've been licensed to practice law for all of 20 months, and I could get a jury to believe that you planted the story about Eduardo and the chicken. Watch what else. Why weren't you at Sean's sorority party that night? You think I'm the one that called the police? Doesn't matter. I asked a question, now everybody's thinking about it. You've lost your jury in the first 10 minutes. Farm animals. Yeah. I was drunk and angry and stupid. And blogging. And blogging. Pay them. In the scheme of things, it's a speeding ticket. That's what Sai will tell you tomorrow. Do you think anybody would mind if I stayed and used the computer for a minute? I can't imagine it would be a problem. Thanks. I appreciate your help today. You're not an asshole, Mark. You're just trying so hard to be.